Hi, this is Vicki Gibbler, and I'm Paul Moore, and we would like to show you how to fit the Give More sling to your client. In donning the sling, have the client put their uninvolved arm through the loop of the shoulder harness, lay the sling across the back. There you go, Vicki, now if you turn towards me. Then before you place the elbow in the sling, what you want to do is take the flaccid hand and place it in the hand piece of the Give More sling. Then allow the arm to hang down, down by the side and pull the elbow strap around the elbow. There we go. Good. Now, in fitting the, the handle, you want to make sure that the handle, which is oval and cross-section, is fit snugly up into the web space between the thumb and the first finger. The cross should be over the dorsal surface of the wrist, and the elbow strap should be about an inch to uh, two inches distal to the olecranon. You want to have 30 to maybe a little less than 30 degrees of flexion at the elbow. If you turn your back to the camera, please. Thank you. The four-tab buckle here. This you want to have centered over the spine, and you want to take it down distal as far as you can. This really takes the pressure off the contralateral axilla. There you go. And turn all the way back around to the front for me. Once you have the sling on, then you can adjust the sling to reduce the subluxation. We can then adjust the tension. We want to reduce the subluxation by tightening the anterior and posterior straps. This is looking pretty good right here. Now, if notice she's in a little bit of internal rotation. I can reduce that by tightening the posterior strap relative to the anterior strap. 